I want to say thank you for all the likes, the shares, the comments, and all the wonderful messages that you have all left behind and all the comments. I want to say thanks uh, um, and welcome to all newcomers and welcome um, to all the people who are joining us for the first time. Thank you for being here. I hope you will come back. I want to say thank you to all my new YouTube um, subscribers and all the people who have subscribed to um, my channel and um, <laughs> my um, um, my websites and stuff. Thank you, thank you, thank you for all the love you share with me and all the love that you sent to me. I want to say if you'd like more in-depth and personal reading, Please look at the bottom of this video. There is an, um, an appointment form that you can just press on the um, link and you go right to um, where you could order a reading. Um, I make sure that my reading is not expensive because I think that everyone should be um, able to um, get an energy reading because um, you will find out things about yourself that you would never imagine. I'm going on into this week because it's the last week in the month of June 2016. And it is the week of the star. And I'm so glad that the universe has sent us this energy because we really needed to end the week on a good note. Okay. This week, um, we're working with... Um, um, the um, energy element of the hair. And when we're working with the energy element of the hair, what happened is that um, we, we, it's like the universe is blessing us with wonderful, wonderful gifts. And by doing that, what happened is that um, just about um, all the people who are having birthdays in this week has been blessed with just wonderful, wonderful um, news, wonderful new experiences are coming in their life, which is so fantastic because the universe always do this. Um, not everyone will be having a real wonderful week because this month was a month of uh, um, changes happening. And whenever this happened, is that um, what happened is that the universe, look, if you think about um, the, the element of hair and the zodiac of water, what do we have? We have like tornadoes, we, we have like hurricanes, we have like um, storms and so. And this is the vibration of the week. So if you're not having birthdays in this week, expect um, like a little rocky week this week okay it's a week of ups and down for the people who vibrate on the um with the angels and guides and so it is the the week of the number 17 energy which is the star and it is archangel um gabriel who is coming out and she says a dream come true believe in yourself the end of a difficult situation and isn't this wonderful because the energies of June was just changes, changes, changes with every zodiac element signs. And everyone was having changes in their life because it was the end of the school period for the, the kids and the students. And for the rest of the people, the universe was actually shaking up your life and removing things out of your life, which you no longer had needed. And now the universe is blessing you with something beautiful. So all the changes was really, you know, like upsets for some people. But Archangel Jovial comes in to say, a dream is going to come true. Believe in yourself because it's the end of a difficult situation. And I'm so happy for everyone out there that this has been moving out. This sort of energy is moving out of your life. Okay. We 16 
and you are the Librans. Okay, hello, hello to all the new Librans. Hello to um, my <laughs> subscribers and all my followers. Uh, welcome if you're new to this channel, and I hope you will return. This is the energy vibration reading for all the Librans out there for um, the week number 26. That is the last week of June 2016. I want to say that this is general reading for and um, more personal personalized reading you can always visit our site and um, request a reading okay this week for you Gemini's what is happening here for you guys it is a week you're vibrating in a week of the hair element which is very good so it's a week where it's the hair element is supporting you as a Gemini because you're or as a Libran because you are a Libra you're a hair sign so um, when we look at the week for you guys it's going to be a good week for you because a lot of energies are helping you because you're vibrating in the week of the hair and you're also a hair sign when we look on Monday the 27th the lovers comes up and the lovers is good because it's the energy vibration of your sister sign that is here to help you balance off a situation in your life when the lovers is here it has to do with a business partner or some situation that you have to deal with in your life so you you have to work out with another individual or another person or a situation that is very prominent in your life that you have to work on and deal with and with what is good is on Tuesday the 28th what happened is that the chariot comes and when the chariot comes it's a yes card so whatsoever you are planning on doing it is going to be okay because the energy vibrations is going to be there to help you in another um, side of this coin it's you are a Libran and um, um, the energy vibration for you is that you have to make a decision but whatever decision you make you are going to be successful and triumphant in this situation okay because it's a situation that the energy vibration is pushing you to make a decision and it's going to be okay because on Wednesday the energy of the fire energy comes up and that is the energy vibration of strength and strength is here to help you to accomplish whatsoever you had decided the day before and it's going to help you on Thursday the 30th of June 2016 what is happening for you liberals is that uh, there is a situation that is there that you yourself is not really um, accepting you know and it's like um, your intuition is calling up on you and you know um, the, the, the energy vibration is a water energy and this energy vibration uh, has to do because the moon has to do with your intuition and what is happening for you is that there are situations that are playing that you do not want to accept or do not want to look at and you have to accept these accept the energy vibration because they're pulling towards you so on Thursday you will have like a little ups and downs and stuff coming at you and you're uh, you, you are realizing stuff that were happening that you weren't aware of so it's like the you know it's like the devil playing a trick on you let's say something like you but it is something that you have not you didn't want to um, look at and you didn't want to accept and it's like um, the moon is here bringing you that illusion to awake you up to your psychic so on Thursday something some things are going to come out that you weren't aware of and it's going to like hit you off your feet but it's okay because on Friday the 1st of July what comes in is the star and the star is what's happening for you with the star is that the star is helping you to help you to um, bring out a wish and a dream so on Friday something beautiful is going to happen to you something that you were looking forward to um, the energy vibration of the hair sign is uh, your sister sign is here bringing a little gift for you so um, maybe you had you were thinking about something or you wanted something to happen well on Friday it's going to happen okay and Saturday the 2nd of July it's going to be a day of you looking at yourself 
but you're going to be balancing out the whole week so on Saturday you're going to be looking back to see what happened in the week but you will be balancing that all week because you're a liberal you know you 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 are someone who likes to balance out things okay it is a good week for you because um, I, you're vibrating in the in the in the hair um, energy vibration and you are in hair energy energy person also so um, it's like the universe is just like blessing you with stuff on Sunday it's wonderful because another energy vibration is another hair energy vibration so this week is just so profound with all the energy vibration of the hair that is helping you in this week so it's going to be a wonderful week for you liberants out there it's it's one of those weeks that um, um, through the whole month of June there was just a lot of stuff coming at you and now in this week it's so it says the universe is going to bring you like little blessings just gonna bring you a little blessing because there's so much energy vibration that is supporting you in the whole week so as you look at it you have something to do with a business partner or a lovers or some but it's a situation that you need to make a, cho a, a choice on, on on Tuesday. On Wednesday, you're going to look for inner strength and you're going to have that to support you. But on Thursday, a lot of stuff is going to come out on Thursday. Things that was you were not um, aware of is going to come out on Thursday. And on Friday, the star is going to come out, which is going to bring you a little gift. And that is so wonderful. So, you know, um, it's going to be a good week for you. Um, 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 a really good week for you uh, liberants out there um please <laughs> this is just wonderful for you liberants and um the overall energies that you will um see that um it's going to be okay going further and we're going to the special segment the special segment the overall energy as i have said it was the agma so it was a week of people connecting with themselves, people going inwards and really meditating, taking the time to really connect to themselves, to find out to what is it that I need to do because the energies and the energies vibration that is going on on the hurt is taking away things out of people's life so that they can connect with themselves to find out their true divine potential. And, you know, the energy of the week, the energy of the week was just so fantastic because um, it was it was a week of communication, um, a week of ideas, thought and intellect, you know, so you will have obstacles in this week um, for the people who were having like um, difficulties. It's a week of difficulties because it's a week of the element as hair and the zodiac um, element as water. I mean, yeah, I did say it. It's like storm hurricanes, okay? So that was a week for most of the zodiac side, but the half of the people who were um, having birthdays, they had a wonderful week. And, you know, the color of the week is always, it, it was blue. So it's communication, speech, you know, expression, imagination. So it has to do with your throat chakra because it's blue. Um, anything that has to do with communication, it was blue. So you had to communicate something um, with somebody else and deal with a situation. Okay. The 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 oh, the the crack the 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 strong energy of this week was you know a number eight, which is power, authority, strength with, you know, um, an organization structure or control, you know, and that's what you needed to find within yourself in this week. All right. That's the overall energy of this week. Moving on to the special segment. And um, we are looking at the energy and the energy, the week of the, um, the 26th week, the energy was hostility. And yes, I did say that on and, and you know I can repeat myself but it was a week of you know the, it was like a storm and an hurricane week so you have people coming with uh, to you with hostility in their heretic feel and yet that is not really nice but 
you know, sometimes you need to deal with these people so you can clear the contracts and move them out of your lives. And sometimes it is very beautiful to do that, okay? This next card that I have, it is from the map and it says Deep Frozen. And yes, some of you guys saw it. I saw it in the reading. It's like you were froze deep. You didn't know where to go. You are, you were just, yeah, as the hangman laying in limbo. So this, th this energy of this week was so perfect because as I said, it's like a storm and a hurricane and now you're just froze. Okay. Not all of the world is <laughs> that you're froze, but being froze, deep froze, meaning that you have no idea which direction, what steps to take in your life. And this is why you were feeling like this. The energies was just um, um, bringing you, it was just pulling you all over the place in this week. Okay. The next um, card that I have is from the Wisdom um, Oracle. And it says, the Rainbow Prince, Compassion and Perseverance. Oh my God, this is so beautiful. I'm so sorry, Ponies. But, um, you know, I told you the energies of the week was just like it's blowing you like the wind. And the Rainbow Prince, because there's so much divine help. There's so much energies out there that can help us whenever we're going through a time of being pull, pulled in two directions or um, being in a situation that we just feel blocked and we can't move out of this in that situation. And the Rainbow Prince is here to say to you, you know, I am bringing you compassion and the energy of perseverance to persevere in whatever you're trying to achieve in your life. And the last card, I've changed it up because I look at the energy of this card and it's a beautiful one for the number 26 energy on this last card. It is from the Oracle and it says, happy, happy, happy. So, you know, this is it. Sometimes we have to go through a very rough period in our life before we can come to the happiness. It's like at the end of the rainbow, there is always a pot of gold and we have to like will go through the bushes and um, the storm and the rain and the hurricanes. And at the end of the day, at the end of the rainbow, there's always a pot of gold. And this is saying, happy, happy, happy. And I want to say to you, thank you for coming. Please like and share these videos for personal reading. Please click on our um, booking um, link. And please like and share, thumbs up, and I want to say to you, namaste until next week.